Our planet holds many mysteries and challenges beyond what you might think. There are beautiful places that seem like they only exist in dreams or science fiction movies. Some places, gifted to us by the Creator, are majestic in nature. Like strange islands and rugged landscapes that somehow, through some magical touch, become unbelievably beautiful. Among them, over many millennia of human history, there are places where human hands have carved out wonders amidst nature and man-made landscapes, coincidentally gathered together. All waiting for you to marvel at in this video. Grand Prismatic Spring, Yellowstone National Park. Once upon a time in Yellowstone National Park, there was a magnificent site known as the Grand Prismatic Spring. It was the talk of the park, with its vibrant colors painting a picture that drew photographers and tourists from far and wide. According to the folks at the U.S. National Park Service, this wondrous spring boasted a ring of colors stretching 200 to 300 feet wide and plunging 121 feet deep. It was like a giant colorful eye staring up from the earth, impossible to ignore. But what made this spring even more special were the tiny inhabitants living within it, the thermophiles. These microscopic organisms had a peculiar preference for heat. Thriving in the scorching waters of the spring, now, here's where it gets interesting. Not all thermophiles were the same. The toughest ones, residing in the hottest waters, were either transparent or yellow. Meanwhile, their cousins living in the cooler edges of the spring flaunted shades of orange, brown and green. It was a bustling community of heat-loving creatures. adding to the allure of the already captivating Grand Prismatic Spring. Photographers aimed their lenses, tourists marveled at its beauty, and nature continued its intricate dance, creating a spectacle that would be remembered for generations to come. Wadi Rum, Jordan. In the southern reaches of Jordan lies a vast desert expanse known as Wadi Rum. Stretching across 277 square miles, according to Wadi Rum.jo. It's a place where the sands seem to stretch on endlessly. The landscape takes on an otherworldly appearance. Imagine stepping foot into a realm that feels like it could be Mars itself. A 
as you wander through this dramatic wilderness. You'll be greeted by towering sandy valleys that rise over a mile high. Red dunes that seem to stretch forever. And rock formations that twist and turn in mesmerizing patterns. It's a sight that leaves you in awe. As if nature herself had sculpted this terrain with divine hands. In the early 20th century, during the Arab revolt against the Ottoman Turks, a British liaison officer named Thomas Edward Lawrence found himself amidst the grandeur of Wadi Rum. He was so moved by its vastness and majesty that he described it as vast, echoing and godlike, as recounted by Wadi Rum nomads. Lawrence was so inspired by his experiences in Wadi Rum that he penned a book titled Seven Pillars of Wisdom, immortalizing his adventures and the spirit of the desert. This tale later found its way onto the silver screen in the iconic 1962 movie, Lawrence of Arabia. Interestingly, many scenes from this epic film were shot right in the heart of Wadi Rum, as documented by IMDb. Waitomo Glowworm Caves, New Zealand. Imagine trading a night under the twinkling stars for a spectacle of a different kind. The mesmerizing Glowworm Caves of New Zealand. If you're up for an adventure, these caves might just be the perfect destination. As per NewZealand.com, the Waitomo Caves stand out as some of the finest spots to witness these glowing wonders. Whether you opt for a boat ride, a kayak adventure, or prefer to explore on foot, the journey through the Waitomo Caves promises a breathtaking encounter with thousands of glowworms illuminating the darkness. Picture this. As you venture deeper into the caves, the surroundings transform into something straight out of a science fiction tale. The cave walls come alive with the soft glow of these tiny creatures, casting an ethereal light that guides your path like a celestial map. Sala de Uyuni, Salt Flats, Bolivia. Picture a vast expanse of gleaming whiteness stretching as far as the eye can see. That's the Sala de Uyuni in Bolivia. The largest salt flat on the entire planet, as revealed by the European Space Agency. It's so immense that astronauts cruising above in their spacecraft can easily spot its shimmering expanse. Covering over 3,800 square miles, this colossal salt flat is not just large, it's mind-bogglingly huge. And get this, in the heart of the flat, the salt reaches depths of up to 32 feet, 
creating a landscape that's as surreal as it is stunning. According to the wise folks at saladouni.com, this expansive wonderland holds over 10 billion tons of salt within its boundaries. But that's not all. There's an even more fascinating secret hidden beneath the surface. Beneath the salt, lying quietly in the depths, are an astonishing 70% of the world's lithium reserves. It's like a treasure trove waiting to be discovered beneath the monumental salt flat. For adventurers seeking an experience like no other, a journey to Bolivia's Altiplano to witness these captivating salt flats is an absolute must. Sossusvle, Namib Desert. Imagine standing at the base of towering giants, their fiery red peaks reaching towards the heavens. These are the majestic dunes of Sossusvle, some of the tallest on the entire planet, soaring to nearly 1,300 feet, as shared by the travel experts at Sossusvle. It's no wonder these monumental structures attract visitors from far and wide, making them one of Namibia's most sought-after destinations. Nestled within the expansive Namib Naukluft National Park, this otherworldly landscape resembles something straight out of a science fiction movie. The terrain is reminiscent of the Martian surface, with its barren beauty captivating the hearts of all who venture here. But what's in a name? The word Sossusvlei holds a deeper meaning, translating to dead end in the local language. It refers to the dunes' remarkable ability to halt the flow of the Tsauchab River, creating a stunning vista of contrast between life and desolation. It's taken millions of years for nature's hand to sculpt these iconic red dunes, a testament to the enduring power of wind and time. The fine dust that forms these dunes embarks on an epic journey, originating from the mighty Orange River, the longest river in South Africa. Lake Hillier, Australia. Picture a scene straight out of a dream, or perhaps a sci-fi movie. Nestled on Middle Island in Western Australia lies Lake Hillier, a body of water that defies expectations with its shocking pink hue. It's a sight so surreal that it feels like it belongs on another world entirely. As you gaze upon Lake Hillier, you're greeted by a striking contrast of colors. The pink waters of the lake stand out against the deep blue of the Indian Ocean, while lush green forests frame the scene, creating a breathtaking panorama that's truly unforgettable. But what's the secret behind this rosy phenomenon? According to the experts at Hiller Lake, scientists are still puzzling over the exact cause. One theory points to the presence of Dunaliella salina, a type of microalgae found in the lake, which produces carotenoids, a red pigment. However, halophilic bacteria, fond of salty environments, might also have a hand in the lake's unique coloration. Some even suggest that a chemical reaction between the salt and sodium bicarbonate could be at play.
measuring approximately 2,000 feet in length and 820 feet in width. This mysterious salmon pink lake is best viewed from above, where its vibrant hues can truly be appreciated in all their glory. It's a natural wonder that captivates the imagination and invites endless speculation, reminding us of the marvels that lie waiting to be discovered in the world around us. Lensua, Maranhenses, National Park, Brazil. Imagine a landscape unlike any other where vast stretches of white dunes stretch out as far as the eye can see. This is Lonsoir Maranhenses National Park, a place of enchantment and wonder, as described by the travel gurus at Lonely Planet. From May to September, a magical transformation takes place as rainwater collects in the crystal clear pools nestled between the pristine white dunes. The contrast between the shimmering waters and the striking sands creates a scene straight out of a fairy tale. Spanning over 43 miles along the coast and extending more than 30 miles inland, the dunescape of Lonsoir Maranhenses is a sight to behold. The name Lensoir translates to bedsheets in Portuguese, a fitting moniker for the rolling white dunes that blanket the landscape like a sea of soft fabric. For those seeking the ultimate experience, the best time to visit is during the months of June, July, and August, when the lagoons are at their most breathtaking. It's a time when nature puts on its finest display, inviting visitors to immerse themselves in the beauty and tranquility of this otherworldly paradise. Danakil Depression, Ethiopia. Prepare yourself for a journey into the heart of desolation. Welcome to the Danakil Depression in Ethiopia, a place so forbidding and alien that it's been dubbed the gateway to hell by the BBC. Here, you'll find yourself stepping into a realm that feels more like the surface of Venus than the Earth we know. Picture this, the air thick with choking sulfuric acid and chlorine gases, while acidic ponds and geysers dot the landscape like scars upon the Earth. It's a scene that seems ripped from the pages of a science fiction novel, yet it's all too real in the Danakil Depression. According to the BBC, temperatures here soar to staggering heights, regularly reaching a scorching 113 degrees Fahrenheit, 45 degrees Celsius. It's no wonder this place is considered one of the hottest on the entire planet. Nestled over 330 feet below sea level in a rift valley, the Danakil Depression is a testament to the raw power of nature. Rift valleys, as explained by the Geological Society, form when tectonic plates drift apart at divergent plate boundaries, creating rifts in the Earth's surface. Here, underlying volcanic activity sculpts the landscape as the Earth is pulled apart at its seams. But the wonders of the Danakil Depression aren't confined to the ground below. Some of its most striking features can even be spotted from space, as noted by the NASA Earth Observatory. It's a place where the boundaries between Earth and alien worlds blur, leaving visitors awestruck by the sheer magnitude of nature's power and beauty.
Every destination leaves an indelible mark on our hearts and minds, right? But fear not, adventurers, for our journey is far from over. Join us in the next video as we embark on a thrilling expedition to explore natural wonders of Vietnam. The most fascinating places in Vietnam.